Hey guys, I'm in Scarborough and let me show you guys. I'm at Danforth. So usually people like going to Danforth um, market for West Indian food. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just here with my mom. I think she's just getting a few things. And that's really it. Before I used to like coming here, but since I'm in Jamaica all the time, I don't really fancy these places. <laughs> Yeah, I'll get them here for you. What is bomber blue? I've seen your vlog sometimes. I haven't seen oh. it. Look if they have the fever grass. Fever grass? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. 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 Okay, I'm just gonna get this. Okay, we're at Skyland. I'm still at Scarp, bro. Oh, this Skyland. I think if you're in Scarborough, you already know about this place. <laughs> Let's pick up a few things. The only thing that I miss about Canada is the cheap pricing of everything. Because Jamaica, <laughs> and their pricing is completely different. Oh, it's too much for you, Okay, I'm in Dollar Tree, my fave place. Because everything's so affordable. <laughs> so I'm picking up a lot of stuff just to bring to Jamaica. Um, to ship down, to put in my suitcase. And I'm just like packing up a lot of things. I'm stacking up a lot of things. The next day basically we just did something quick we went i just did errands i went to dollar tree i went to danfort market i went to just listen i kind of remember what i missed about canada was danfort market wait a minute i'm not down for my dollar tree because of how cheap everything is <laughs> and in jamaica you'd buy those same things and it'd be like triple the price right so i missed dollar tree i missed that we had to get gas and i was like oh i thought Jamaica. I was sitting in the car for so long. I was like, wait, I thought we were in Jamaica where they pump the gas for us. Anyways, oh yeah, and then I was in Ajax, and then I went to the beauty supply store. Let me show you guys what glasses I got. You guys are probably like, why is there concealer right here? I do this all the time when I'm doing my eyebrows. So the excess concealer that's on the brush, I put it on my face, and then just take from my face, and put it under my eye. I used to put it on my hand, but I'm just so it gets on my shirt. So I use wipes and clean off. If I put it on my face, it's so much more easy because foundation is gonna go over it. So I don't have to worry about wiping it off and stuff. And that's a little hack if anyone's interested in it. I went to um, the beauty supply store in Ajax. I don't really, I'm not really a fan of that one because I feel like the one in Pickering is way better in front of the Pickering Town Center. But I just got these eyelashes for $2.99. I just needed something to wear to put on. So I'm currently just getting, I'm just doing like quick makeup and then going to hang out with my friend that you guys are going to see. I noticed that um, more and more of you guys are starting to recognize me and saying hi to me. To this day, I feel like um, I have a small following and people don't really know me because on Instagram, I only have like such a little amount of followers, like 5,000 followers on Instagram and stuff. So I'm like, people don't even recognize me and realize me. But even when I was in the airport in Toronto and I was waiting for my sister to pick me up, a few people noticed me and then I was in Scarborough. <laughs> As you guys saw earlier in this clip, and like people noticed me too, so I was like, Oh, that's so nice! So, oh, and I got this gel um eyelash glue, but this one's from I Vent I Envy by Kiss. This was at the beauty supply store, store too, and I think this was $3.99. I can afford everything in Canada because Jamaica is so expensive with like majority of things, so everything in Canada seems so cheap to me now, <laughs> even though I never thought it was expensive, but. Just completely cheap. Like things that I'm just like, ooh, I'm paying twenty dollars for that. I'm like, I'm gonna pick it up because in Jamaica I'll be paying two grand, two five. That's twenty five dollars, thirty dollars. I'll be paying extra more for that. So, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna get ready and I'll see you guys in the next. Clip. Put yourself together. Guys, look what this girl gave me. She's so nice to me. She bought me a little present. This is so cute. Should I open it now? all cute goodies and stuff she's like oh i just wanted to give you a gift because i haven't seen you in so long and your birthday just passed <laughs> this is nice thank you yeah, so i'm back we were in the house talking for so long so i'm back and we're getting food now 
Guys, we're at McDonald's now. I haven't had McDonald's in so long, so I'm just ordering. And no one else wants to be in the vlog, so they're hiding. Do you even know what you want? Yeah, I want um, a large fries. A large fry. Um, and two Junior McChicken. And a medium fry. Um, two medium iced coffee. One with a shot of espresso. Sorry, just the wait, this lady sounds um, very worn out or something. Anyways, I haven't had McDonald's in like so long, so I was like, we have to go get. Yeah. And actually, can you make that medium fry a large? Yeah. And that's everything. I'll just have some of your fries. Sorry, we were talking for so long, so I had to come back on the um, How much did you say it was? I think like 18. Fries. I think that was a girl. No, no, no. What's your favorite fries? Is McDonald's fries are my favorite fries from like fast food junk. Definitely McDonald's fries. Yeah. It's like un. Is this so salty? So salty? It's so cute. Mm. <laughs> <Bah. laughs> <laughs> What's the most burgers you guys can eat in one sitting? Mm. Just say the junior chicken. Actually, I can eat like a junior chicken and like a cheeseburger, but I can't do like two junior chicken. I think the most I ate was like. Five. What? Oh in one God. sitting, yeah. I don't think I went more than that. When did you do that? It was probably when I was in high school. Oh my God. So, if you guys just want more vlogs from me, give it a thumbs up. And then I have more uh, Toronto vlogs that you guys can watch, sir. My lipstick's coming up. Oh, I don't really like these eyelashes. They kind of look too um, plasticky, but they're $3. So. so, today, I'm with someone. We're going to just like go to the mall, most likely go get food after, and then that's for this part. But I'm gonna bring you guys along and stuff. I could leave your wig on, so hopefully, it doesn't look too bad in this vlog. I need to know if I trust her to do anything else right now. So, my pictures are crazy, I don't want it. Mm -mm. Oh, I got screenshots of the promo. <laughs> no, no, that's a good deal. I always wanted to go there to this. Like, what about upstairs where the like elk are so funny? <laughs> Like the clothes that I have, nothing fits. So I'm no. just getting, yeah, getting oh, all of these. Well, some new jeans. All my jeans are just like um, just worn out. Like even the ones I'm wearing now, they're yeah. just worn. <laughs> so what are we like supposed this. to do? And then put it around your neck. If it touches, I know I'm a size one though. If it, it doesn't, then it's supposed to be good. Is it? Because it's supposed to be double the width of your neck, your waist. But if you're size one, it should be fine. I'm usually in these stretchy too. Yeah. Okay, so we're at, where is it? Urban Behavior? Urban Behavior. Yeah, so I'm getting like these because you guys know I love just wearing these just like as casual wear to like do errands. We only found dollars, so why not? Should I get a yellow too? Yeah, why not? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm trying on these boots. Wait, is it recording? <laughs> oh yeah, recording. Um, these masks make me feel so hot. <laughs> That's sick. They look nice off, but on the feet, it looks weird, doesn't it? Yeah, but they do look nice. Are you sure they look nice? Oh, they do, actually. Yeah. The screen looks so tiny. Yeah. Okay, this is how. I'll just... Okay, there's just like this random open space in the mall here. So here's the mall. And then, so I'm like, hey, let us just go and take pictures in here. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna do. Follow me on Instagram. Okay, <laughs> I'm in the change room. <laughs> and these are the fur, fur shorts. These are ugly, guys. These are my um, ripped up tights. Not ripped up, bleach out tights. And I wear them under my pants so I can just stay warm. <laughs> these look so bad. They make me look so squared. And this is a size zero, Old Navy sizing. Oh, I'm in Old Navy, by the way. So these are a no. Let me know if you guys do this too. Wear tights underneath your jeans, like during the colder months. Okay, these are the second ones. They don't fit tight tight, but they fit comfortable. This is a size zero as well. So I'm just gonna get them because they're just comfortable. Their jeans are their jeans are very stretchy. Okay, so this is like a yeah, the cake box. You just buy basically cake out of a vending machine, so this is cool. So we're gonna try it out. We're gonna see. I just wanna see what this is all about, because yeah. So they have red velvet for ten okay, all these are ten dollars. Oh, you can get a full cake. Rainbow chocolate. What? Vanilla confetti. 
Wow, $50. Wow. It must be of good quality, maybe. So this is how it looks. Oh, we're in the Oshawa Center, by the way, if anyone's wondering. Anyways, I think we can buy cake at Eastside Mario's, right? Uh, I think so. Okay, let's just do that. Because they don't have cheesecake, and cheesecake's my fave. Yeah, I was going to say that we're going to Eastside Mario's right now. I'm done shopping. I just mainly bought, like, shorts because I need shorts for Jamaica. And then when I was at Urban Planet, I keep calling it Sirens. They don't have Sirens anymore? No, I think you have to go to Pickering. Wow. Yeah, so I just bought jeans because they had $15 jeans, even though I bought my jeans mostly at Guess because they just fit me nicer, I guess. I mainly got shorts. I went to Old Navy and I bought shorts. And then, what did I do? We went to Urban Behavior. I think that was the first time I've ever been in that store. And then I bought like footwear and then two, a few shorts maybe. Yeah. And then Old Navy. Um, Old Navy. I just listen. Old Navy shorts were the most comfortable shorts I've ever put on, and it's weird. We're gonna go eat because I'm hungry. So, well, I'm in the Oshawa Center, by the way. If anyone's wondering too. <laughs> Should I take pictures with the Golden Hour? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go over there quickly. Let me. Okay, guys. We're done shopping. I think my wig's slipping off because I have a ponytail under this. You guys don't even know. Anyways, we're gonna go to Eastside Morrow's. We're here. We just pulled up. It's across the street from the Oshawa Center. And let me tell you, let me tell you, it looks empty in there and it looks like no cars are here. So we're going to call before we go in just to make sure that they're taking, but they should be. Yeah, let me call. Yeah, so. Our dining room is now open with new safety measures in place. Visit eastsidemario.com for more details. To place an order for delivery, call ahead pickup or to follow up on an existing This is an Oshawa location, right? Yeah. Stevenson. Um, this, who likes this pink shirt? It's so like hot pink and vibrant. This top is so pink and vibrant. Well, it says they're open, but this is weird. Who cares? As long as we wait here, we're gonna. We're just being lazy. And for the restaurant address, this says they're open. Dine in, take out, no contact delivery, close to none. Look at me vlogging, guys. Hi, I was just calling to see, are you guys open for dine-in? Yes, we are. Okay. All right, thank you. No worries. All right, bye. Listen, like, I think about Jamaica, right? I come here and I forget how nice customer service is in Canada. <laughs> because in Jamaica, we know that the customer service, like, in a lot of places, I'm not going to say everywhere, but it's horrendous. And, like, people here are just so nice. It's funny you said that, because when I was in Turks and Caicos, we went to a Jamaican restaurant. And it was bad and customer service. We told him, my cousin said, I'm allergic so to um, peanut. Yeah. So I said, okay, before we order, you do your order first. If, you're, if, they can't, if you can't he eat here, we'll leave. Um, sir, is there peanut oil in the fish cakes? Um, why? Uh, because someone's allergic to peanuts. I don't know, man. Maybe you should stay away from the fried stuff. What? No. He's a waiter. He said, oh, he's like, actually. Was he Jamaican too? I don't like that. I don't like that. He, he don't said, like, that. actually, maybe you should just stay away from the fried stuff. And then we were just like, okay. He's like, okay, girls, are you ready to order? And I said, no, 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 no. Can you take his order? Can you go find out? If not, then we're not eating here. I'm like, don't ask us to That's, pick our order. Yeah, I don't like that. Do you like want that. us to leave our friend eating dirt? Like, Who says that? Like, oh, maybe you should just stay away from the fried stuff. Like, huh? This man said, oh, I'll be back. Oh, yeah, unfortunately there is uh this is made with peanut oil like sir we asked you for a reason then he's just like oh you, you can eat the salad and i'm like you, you really gotta think we're gonna sit here oh wow okay we're at east side <laughs> uh, my life feels so meaningless here okay we're here we're gonna order but i need to um sanitize my hand do you ever get started I just go straight no. into meals. Yeah, I don't either. Is it weird? <laughs> I just go straight into meals. Like, I just start eating. Okay, let's see what we're gonna eat. Hmm. Okay, we just said, we're like, she was like, do we go into starters? So, like, do people eat starters? <laughs> yeah, or do you guys go into the meal? It depends how I feel. Sometimes yeah. I'm just so hungry. I'm like, just give me Anything. the food now. And someone else will always order, like, the appetizer. Right over to the Okay, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Oh, I forgot. They give us garlic here. Oh, yeah. So, she, she, she was like, oh, I forgot that Eastside Mario's gives you uh, garlic bread. Cool things. That's so cool, Sometimes guys. We're on our second garlic bread. Yes. Yeah. Delicious. Right? Oh, the quality is so good in here. Their garlic bread is so good, but everyone knows that. That's nothing new. <laughs> it's almost like, um, what's it called? Red Lobster. Um, their bread. But now they sell it at Costco. Red lobster. I haven't ate there in a long time. Yeah, me I really don't like Swiss Chalet. Oh, yeah, it feels, Swiss it tastes like, like they just warm up their food in the microwave. Swiss Chalet is like 
if you live in the country <laughs> and it's that little diner in the country. As I grow older, I like quality things now. Yeah. Like I will spend the extra money to have like the quality food, the quality experience, the quality clothing. Yes, like when I was younger, I didn't care. Like I don't care. There's even something now I don't care about. But majority of things now I start caring. How many outfits and silence? Did you want any parm on there? Yes, thank you. No worries, just let me know when to stop. No, like how many? Five minutes later. Sorry, we can stop. Thank you. No worries. It's so fun. Okay, so I got um this. They brought salad. Oh my gosh, look what she got. <laughs> chicken. Um, bites? Or no, no it's like a whole chicken. Fried. Wow. And we're getting more bread. I'm getting more water. I had enough orange juice, so that's it.